You have disgraced me for the last time, Steel Samurai. The pale moon in the sky cries for your blood. The moon? No, it is you who should gaze upon the moon. It will be the last moon you'll ever see. See you in hell, evil magistrate! The warrior's swords gleam and strike in the moonlight. One has fallen. But who? Only the moon knows. Don't miss next week's exciting episode. The Dark Messenger returns. Magistrate. Whoa! Stop waving that broom around! Oh! Nick! I didn't know you were here! Of course I'm here. What was that surreal show you were watching? What? Nick, you mean... You don't know the Steel Samurai? He's only the most popular TV hero for young people! Young? Like, how young? Um, 10 years old? Then what the heck are you doing getting all excited? Hey! I'm only 17! That's 17! See? I'm a teen! Not like you, Nick. Hey! Don't talk to me like I'm your grandpa or something! I'm only 24 myself! Then watch it with me! He's really cool! And it's really popular! When they asked grade school kids what they wanted to be, Steel Samurai was number one! I really worry about kids these days. Gramps! Well, the Steel Samurai's over. I guess it's time to close up the office. I guess. Wish we had some clients. A month has passed since my trial. Mia's murder was the talk of the town for some time. But no one paid any attention to the Wright and Co. law offices. How am I going to pay the rent this month? It'll be okay. I'm sure some big client is just around the corner. Hello? This is Phoenix. Nick! Maya, what? It's still early. It's the Steel Samurai! The Steel Samurai got arrested! Huh? You mean that guy on that show? Yes! They're saying that the Steel Samurai killed a villain! Um, isn't that what he's supposed to do? Yeah, on TV! Yeah, on TV. No! I mean, he actually did it! In real life! He skewered a villain with a samurai spear! I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. Just come to the office, quick! Please, Nick. <sighs> huh? Now for the morning news. Actor Will Powers, who plays the lead role in the popular kids' show The Steel Samurai, Warrior of Neo Old Tokyo, was arrested yesterday on the suspicion of murder. The victim was reported to be Jack Hammer, a fellow co-star who plays the show's primary villain known as the Evil Magistrate. According to police, Mr. Hammer's body was discovered yesterday afternoon inside one of the recording stages at the Global Studios lot here in the city, still wearing the Evil Magistrate costume. Police believe the murder weapon was the Samurai Spear, the Steel Samurai's weapon of choice which was found stuck through Mr. Hammer's body. Further information is still pending upon further investigation. Oh no, no! It's a nightmare! The Steel Samurai is over! The world is over! Yes? Right and Co. Law Offices, how may I help you? What? Nick! It's the Steel Samurai! What? what? Yes. Yes, of course. We'll be right there. Let's go, Nick! Go? Go where? They have the Steel Samurai down at the detention center. And I've decided this will be our first case. Come on! Uh, Maya, calm down! You're gonna tear my arm off! What's wrong, Maya? It's him. In the flesh. Um, is that guy really him? What do you mean, that guy? Of course it's him! Will Powers, our client. 
That's him. Um, maybe I shouldn't be saying this, but he definitely did it. Murder. At least once. Maybe twice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you saying? Um... Yes? Is something wrong? No, no! This is getting off to a great start. I know, I know. You're disappointed, aren't you? D disappointed Oh, no! Oh, no. No, it's okay. This is the real me. When I got the part of the Steel Samurai, with that mask, I decided that I would never show my face in the public until the job was over. It's the kids, you know? I didn't want to wreck their dreams. But I guess it didn't matter. So much for dreams. I wonder what they think of the Steel Samurai now. <laughs> Nick, he's a good guy. I mean, he's good. Yeah. He didn't do it. Now it's just a matter of proving it. Maybe you could start by telling us what happened? Yes, of course. It was like it was only yesterday. Uh, actually, it was only yesterday. The cast had come down to Global Studios for a run-through of the next episode. We went through a few action sequences at 10 that morning, and there was a rehearsal scheduled for 5 in the afternoon. But when 5 came around, and the staff gathered at the studio, the evil magistrate was found lying in a crumpled heap near the set. They took off his mask, and discovered he was Jack Hammer! Dead! He had been expertly skewered with the samurai spear! The... samurai spear? Yes, there's a long spear that I... Uh, that the steel samurai uses as a weapon. Could you explain to me exactly what the steel samurai is? Nick! How could you say such a thing? I'm sorry, sir. I apologize for my partner. He's new to this and a bit out of touch with the world. Hey! Who's new to this? No, it's alright, really. The Steel Samurai is the lead character in a popular kids show. He walks the streets of Neo Old Tokyo, fighting battles after battle against the evil magistrate and his minions. Of course, he never really defeats the evil magistrate. Although, I guess he did defeat him this time. I... I see. Neo Old Tokyo? Who comes up with these names? Uh, Mr. Powers, where were you on the day of the murder? Well, that morning, I came to the lot at 9. We worked through some action scenes until noon, since the afternoon rehearsals were set to begin at 5. But I was a little tired. So after lunch, I took a nap in my dressing room. When I woke up, it was after 5 and I was late for the rehearsal. I hurried to the studio and found everyone looking shocked. That's when they arrested me on the spot and brought me here. He was sleeping the entire afternoon of the murder? Some action hero. What will the kids think? <laughs> I think I should probably check out the scene of the murder. Right. Global Studios. I'll draw you a map. And here. You might need this too. What's this? Written acknowledgement of representation. Trust me, when you meet the security lady, you'll understand. Wow! Come on, Nick! Let's go! I'm willing to bet ten bucks she asks for an autograph. Thank you, Mr. Powers. We'll do our best. Good luck. Wow! So this is where they make the Steel Samurai show. Awesome! Aren't you excited? Hey, you there! You want to go in? You gotta go through me! Uh, oh. Sorry. We're, um, lawyers. Oh, yeah? Well, that's great. I'm security, and it's my job to make sure that gawkers like you stay out! Gawkers? Gawkers! Sightseers! Tourists! I know the type! You heard about the incident and came to snoop around! Used today! Something horrible happens and all you can think of is sightseeing! Wasting your time in a place like this! Don't you have jobs you should be doing? Or do lawyers not work like the rest of us? Maybe I should become a lawyer too! Sounds like a life of ease to me! No work, just loafing around all day as you please! Well, when I was young, things were a mite different! Mind you, we didn't prance around in strange heavy clothes! What are um, you coming to these days? Nick, my son a cult will I grow up to be like her? Like please well, say no! I don't know, it's them. possible! Hey! Listen to when you're being spoken to! Use today! So, what do you do here at the studios? At Global Studios, we make children's dreams come true! In fact, in my younger days... No! You were a star? Only a little twinkle between the stars here, I'm afraid, dearie. This place really has gone downhill, you know. 
but 10 years ago? Now that was a studio of dreams! Hammer was a big star back then, too, he was. Uh, Hammer? A victim, dummy! The evil magistrate! He's been reduced to playing villains now! Not exactly the best material to work with. What kind of person was Jack Hammer? What kind of person? Oh, if you only knew. Jack Hammer will live on in many hearts as the ultimate action hero. He was simply dashing in the Dynamite Samurai series. Should I have heard of that? But there was an accident during filming five years ago. He got an unlucky break after that. Reduced to playing the villain on a children's program. What's more is I heard they were paying him peanuts. It's enough to make you cry. Can you tell me about Mr. Will Powers? He's not a bad kid, but don't be fooled by his mask. You wouldn't want him on the silver screen without it, believe me. Little old ladies watching would lose their lunch. That's probably why he thought that the Seal Samurai was his big chance. No one thought he was capable of doing what he did to poor Jack Hammer. We don't know for certain that Will Powers is guilty. Of course he's guilty. How do I know? I know everything, and that's my job. Why are you so certain Mr. Powers is the killer? I was standing right here yesterday, I was. I was here from 1 o'clock in the afternoon to 5 o'clock, when they found the body. Now the studio where the murder took place is down the path there, so if you want to go to the studio, you have to pass by me. Only one person went by here between 1 and 2.30, when the murder took place. And that person was Mr. Powers? Yes, I saw him. But Mr. Powers says he was sleeping in his dressing room. Oh, I'm sure he would say that. He's no fool. But he was the only person that walked by. He's the killer. You can bet your biscuits on it. Isn't it about time for you to be heading home? There's nothing to see here. Move along! Um, actually, we're here at Mr. Powers' request. Have a look at this. It's a letter of request from Mr. Powers. Hmm. Yes, yes, I recognize the bold, childish scroll. To think he would entrust his fate to use of such unreliable appearance. Really? Anyway, you may pass. But only down the path with the archway towards the studios. No going the other way. That's the employee area. No one allowed inside, pal, were my instructions. The good detective told me himself. Hey. Hey, Nick. Huh? There were maps in the security guard station. Hey, not bad. Those are 50 cents apiece, thank you. Well, time to go, Nick. 50 cents! Hey, ain't you that moiterer from the other day? Ah, it's that confused detective. Hey, pal, you know, Prosecutor Edgeworth is all upset, and it's your fault. I saw him sipping tea and staring gloomily out the window. Hey, if he's depressed, it's all your fault for doing sloppy detective work. <laughs> uh... Um, detective? I think you hurt his feelings. Oh no, I... I'm sorry. Well, to be fair, I think his feelings are easily hurt. You're right, pal. <laughs> it's all my fault. I can blame other people all I want. But I know the truth in my heart. Hey, hey, don't take it so hard. There's always the next case. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Hey, what exactly are you two doing here? Um, well, we're on this case too, pal. Huh? Hey, you can't just go saying pal like that. That's my endearing character trait. I'd say he's a character, all right. So, how is your investigation going? Detective. Well, it's... Hey! I can't tell you that, pal! Nick, maybe you need to be a little more indirect with your questions? Right. So, Detective, mind if I take a look at what you got? Like, the autopsy report? The latest version, if you please. Oh, well, right, right. Sorry about what happened last time, pal. Why was Mr. Powers arrested? Simple, pal! The murder took place right over there in Studio One. Now, the victim entered Studio One at approximately 1 p.m., and at that time, there was no one other than the victim in the studio. According to the autopsy report, 
The time of death was 2.30 p.m. Only one person went to the studio between 1 and 2.30. And that person was none other than Will Powers. No one else, pal. If you think I'm lying, ask the security lady at the main gate. About the security lady? Oh, oh that sweet old lady. What a charmer. Huh? Are, are we talking about the same person? When I showed her my badge, she gave me a donut and some coffee. Sounds like she's a sucker for authority. She even gave me a piece of valuable evidence. What? Uh, what kind of evidence? Well, that, uh, photo. The photo of the Steel Samurai heading toward the scene of the crime. What? Who took that? See the camera up on that gate, pal? The gate? You mean the archway? Yeah, whenever someone walks by, that camera automatically snaps a photo of them. All you have to do is look at the data, and you can see who went where. There's a number plate on the camera. ST1307. That must be the camera ID number. Oh no! Nick, he has evidence! We're finished! Funny. For someone with hard proof, he doesn't look too happy. What's wrong, pal? You seem down! Don't look so happy when you say that. <laughs> I'm glad someone around here seems to be enjoying themselves. What's up with that statue thing? It looks kind of... busted. Oh, the wind was pretty strong yesterday and the head broke off. And took that tree down with it, too. Yeah, that way's kind of dangerous. You should stay out, pal. There's nothing down there anyway. That's where Studio 2 used to be, they tell me. Uh, they don't use it now, though. Um... We'd like to ask the employees here some questions. Yeah, sure thing, pal. Go wherever you like. Of course, you're not gonna find any clues I haven't already found. <laughs> we'll see about that. Come on, Maya! Nick, look! That security lady is in the guard station stuffing her face with donuts! I guess all cops like their donuts. Yeah, and they're soft enough she doesn't need teeth to chew them. Hey, you! Well, are you satisfied Powers is guilty yet? Why didn't you tell us about the security photo, ma'am? Hmm? Oh, that. I just thought it would be more thrilling to talk with the detective himself. These things are important, you know. What can you tell me about the security camera that took the photo? It's automatic. It can tell when someone walks through the gate, see? Then it snaps a photo. Apparently it records the time when it takes the photo too, but I don't bother myself with those details. I just view all the photos on the computer over in the security guard station. I check them every day before going home, I do. The computer in the booth, huh? Come on, Nick! You gotta see this place over here! Huh? Hey! Thanks for waiting, Maya! Check it out, Nick! This is where they do all the behind-the-scenes stuff. Look, there's Power's dressing room! The remains of yesterday's lunch are scattered around. No one's here this soon after the murder. I guess everyone was probably too shocked to clean up. There's a T-bone on one of the plates. Minus the steak. Mmm, T-bone steak! That would've hit the spot. You just had a burger! Yeah, but I have a second stomach just for steaks. What?! Come on, let's check out his dressing room. Power's dressing room. So this is where he was sleeping. Or at least this is where he claims he was sleeping. No one actually saw him taking a nap here, did they? Right. And there's a picture of him near the crime scene. I hope he's telling the truth. For his sake. There's a vast array of cosmetics here. Woo! This is the wig he used in Samurai Boogie Woogie! Nick, try this on! No. And how can you tell the name of a show just by looking at a wig? I, um, kinda like samurai movies. Kinda? There's a bunch of snacks on the table. They must give these to the employees. Some tea and cookies. Nick, I'm hungry. Again. You just had a burger! Yeah, but I have a separate stomach for sweets! How many stomachs does this girl have? Hmm? This must be Power's bag. Hey, don't open that! Look at this thing! An employee card key. That must be Power's. It says, 
Studio One. Let's take it, Nick. Borrow it. You mean borrow? Whatever. <sighs> Come on then. Let's go check out Studio One. What is it? You're real quiet all of a sudden. Doesn't it give you the shivers, Nick? That white tape. It's so, so real. Well, the evil magistrate did die here, and the steel samurai killed him. The murder weapon was the samurai spear. Huh, <laughs> sounds pretty real to me. They outlined where Jack Hammer's body was with tape. They found him in the evil magistrate costume, so I guess that's why the head part looks like a helmet. Funny. I expected a spear stabbing would leave at least a few bloodstains. I guess the costume must have absorbed most of it. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in! I've always wanted to sit in one of these! Hey, Nick! Take a look at that! One of those black and white boards they clap at the start of filming! And look! A megaphone! A real live megaphone! Ready, Ready Nick? Nick? Action! Action! This girl is more troubled than I thought. Look! A ladder! That's a step ladder. So? What's the difference? You need to stop judging things based on narrow-minded cultural assumptions, Nick. Right. Sorry. This girl is out there! Wow! Look at that camera! That must cost a ton! Whoa! It's heavier than I thought! Hey! You! No touching that! Ah, uh, I'm sorry. My partner is a uh, kind of, you know. You know? No, I don't um, know. Who are you? <laughs> who me? I'm an assistant here. I help with props and stuff, moving them around, ordering new ones, etc. We're lawyers representing Mr. Will Powers. Oh, you're WP's people. I don't envy you guys one bit. But do what you can for WP, okay? He'd never hurt a fly. He has to be innocent. Could you tell me anything about the day of the murder? Yes. I was in the studio the whole day. I was the only assistant on staff that day, you see. In the morning, we went through the action sequences in the employee area. WP and Hammer were there, along with everyone else. After eating lunch, Mr. Hammer went to Studio One. Then, I saw WP go into his dressing room. But I didn't see either of them after that. Did you know that Mr. Powers was sleeping in his room? No! I wouldn't go in there unless I had some urgent message for him. I mean, it's his private... What kind of a girl do you think I am? What kind? N no I'm sure you're a fine girl. Um... Um... Sorry. <laughs> so much for getting a confirmation on Powers' alibi. What do we do, Nick? We haven't found anything. If WP was the only one who came to the studio, then he has to be the killer. They even have a photograph. Um, sorry. I know you're busy, but there's been something bothering me. Aha! That's what I'm talking about! A clue! A lead! Well, I don't know about that, but that day, just afternoon, I sensed someone was here. You sensed? Yes. Several times. Some other studio employees, maybe? No, I don't think so. The only thing we had scheduled was an action scene run-through. I was the only assistant here that day. I have a feeling it was someone from... outside. But wait, if someone had come in here, wouldn't that security lady have noticed them? Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry I don't have any better information than that. No, thanks. That helps us a lot. Anything helps. Let's go put that security lady on the spot. What? You're still here? Really? You look as though you've seen a ghost. I wanted to ask you again about yesterday. You came here at 1 o'clock p.m., correct? And the estimated time of Hammer's death was 2.30. Are you sure that Powers was the only one to go through here between those times? Sure as can be! But... We have a witness who thinks there was someone from outside here that day. What?! Are you absolutely sure you were here watching the whole time? <laughs> 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 <laughs>
ma'am? Who was that? Who told you that? Who dare questions me? Eek! All right, you better tell me and tell me quick, you spiky-haired cretin. Someone's been complaining about the work I do, eh? Uh, um, we were just talking to the assistant in Studio One. Her? She's not even a full-time employee! All you youngins are like that nowadays, running your mouth like there's no tomorrow saying this, that, and the other thing. Well, when I was young, let me tell you, we knew a thing or two about respecting our elders. Back then we did, and it's a crying shame that they used today to say what you please about poor old ladies! <laughs> Uh, she left? Well, Nick, this is our chance to do what we can without her looking over our shoulders. Let's check out the booth. Right. This must be the computer that runs the studio security cameras. Nick, maybe we can see that photo of Powers with this computer. Okay, let's give it a try. You know how to work these things, Nick? Looks like I just have to enter a few numbers. Let's see, first I need the date of the murder, and the camera number, ST1307. It looks like the camera turned on at 1 o'clock p.m. that day. That's when the security lady arrived at the guard station. Hey, it printed out a photo. Let's see what we got. Huh? How is this a picture of Will Powers? Well, he is the one who always wears that suit. I guess that's why the security lady thought it was him. I don't imagine the detective was very happy with this photo as evidence. Hey, something's printed on the back. October 15th, 2 o'clock p.m., photo number two. Maybe there's more photo data from that day? But that's the only one in the computer. Let's show her this photo and see what she says. Wait, let's not. Why not? It's never a good idea to reveal your hand to the enemy too soon. Nick! You're craftier than I gave you credit for. Why, you could be the next... evil magistrate! I think this photo is what we needed for the trial. Still, it'd be better if I had some idea who the real killer was.